Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I transform some summer outfits into fall outfits since we're transitioning through seasons right now. It's usually still a little warm in the fall in California, Southern California, so I'm not going to be using like huge heavy coats or anything like that. It's still kind of light and casual. But yeah, I just want to show you how I use certain pieces differently throughout the season. So if you want to see me transform some outfits, please keep watching. This first look is a spaghetti strap length adjustable dress I got from Free People. It's a little too big on me, but it was the last one in that color and I really wanted that lavender. But I paired it with some strappy sandals and my grandma's wicker bag. For the fall transformation of this look, I adjusted the length of the dress and I paired it with a knee-high snakeskin boot. I'm not sure if I'd necessarily pair this lavender dress with snake skin. I would have gone for white boots if I had any, but to be honest, in LA, no color or pattern is too loud, flashy, clashy. There are no rules. This is my any occasion simple black dress. For the summer, I paired with my platform espadrille sandals. And for the fall look, I also paired it with the snakeskin boot. For these two dress looks, I really wish I added some scarves and some beanies to really solidify the fall look, but noted for next time. This is the easiest and the laziest outfit almost every girl in LA has worn. A large or extra large graphic tee usually worn with high socks and some Air Force Ones, but me, I'm just in my sandals. To transform this very basic look into a fall look, I added a long sleeve turtleneck under my t-shirt. If you're not into turtlenecks, just add your favorite long sleeve or thermal. And I also paired this look with my khaki joggers, my Nike Air Vapor Max 97s, and my favorite faux leather fanny pack as a crossbody. This is a one strap casual bodycon dress I got from Zara in the clearance section. And to transform this into a fall look, I layered my oversized button up from ASOS. That is my sister's Nike bucket hat. And I used my Doc Martens for the shoes. In the snapshots, you'll see that I decided to wear some white socks so that they're peeping through over my boots. I love this outfit, it's super light, all Nike. That's a Nike collared shirt and some Nike Terry cloth tear away shorts that are a size too big, but they're so comfy. I like to call this look your favorite stepdad. I got a bunch of slacks from Nasty Gal at the beginning of the year for work, but I do not work in an office anymore and I lost a lot of weight, so all of these slacks are too big on me, but hopefully you get the idea of the outfit I was going for. Now this set is a summer staple. It's a matching set I got from Free People and I paired this with my favorite sandals throughout the summer. I feel like I finally hit the fall transformation look with this outfit. I added my oversized blazer slash coat from ASOS I got a couple years ago as well as this really cool beret that I also got from ASOS and these old style train conductor kind of boots that I got from Aldo. These last two pieces are a casual set from New Apparel. I wore these with sandals, you can wear them with sneakers, perfect for errands or just lounging. 
And for this last look, I added this blazer that I thrifted. And oh, the pockets are fake, which is annoying, but it was six bucks and it's really cute. And for accessories, I added this velvet black hat from the brand The Hundreds that my sister gifted to me for my birthday. Um, again, my favorite fanny pack that I'm using as a crossbody, but I can also use as an actual fanny pack, which um, changes the look up a bit. Really cute. And again, my Doc Martens. I really like this, and I was feeling very Janet Jackson in this outfit. Alrighty, this was the last look. I think this one was my favorite. Um, I just love the different layers. So, hopefully you enjoyed. <laughs> I haven't like worn any stylish outfits in so long because um, we're in quarantine and also the past like three years I was overweight and I was really uncomfortable and all I wore were oversized t-shirts everywhere. I'm a little rusty. Um, I know some outfits may not be favored by other people, but these are what I came up with. So if you enjoyed me transforming my summer outfits into fall, please leave a like, comment, and if you haven't, please subscribe. And let me know if you have any other suggestions as far as video ideas that you'd like me to film. I will be glad to do that for you. I will leave as much information about these outfits and pieces down below, um, but a lot of these were acquired throughout the years, so I may not remember where I got them from. Um, but yeah, thank you.